Now, if a transition takes place from higher energy level to lower energy level, then it is said to be energy gap is very less. So therefore, wavelength will be maximum. As you all know that E is equal to HC by lambda, E is inversely proportional to wavelength. When energy gap is less, wavelength is more. So this transition gives you maximum wavelength. When transition takes place from n equal to infinity to n equal to 1 here, then you will be getting energy gap is more here, that means wavelength will be less. So you will be getting this type of waves whose wavelength is less here. So you will be getting lambda minimum when transition takes place from infinity to the first level. And this is for example, if it is a Lyman series, then how will you find out lambda maximum by lambda minimum by using a shortcut? The formula is going to be 1. n plus 1 whole square by 2 n plus 1, that is. So for case of a Lyman series, you all know that uh, initial will be n equal to 1 here. Therefore, you can substitute here 1 plus 1 whole square by 2 into 1 plus 1 which is going to be 4 by 3 here similarly for example if you want to find out the for Balmer series if you want to find out the lambda maximum by lambda minimum then Balmer series means you know the transition takes place from different energy levels to the second energy level where n equal to 2 here we can consider so therefore 2 plus 1 whole square by 2 into 2 plus 1 therefore 9 by 5 here 